Hello ladies and gentlemen, a very warm welcome to this video, a very warm welcome to another video of mine. Well, today I'm going to talk about the cancer sign people, I mean the cancer moon sign people. I'm going to tell you all how your year 2023 would be. You know, at the starting of the year, you'd be seeing no planets over your moon sign. In the second house, in the Leo sign, in the third house, in the Virgo sign, you wouldn't be seeing any planets. In the fourth house, in the Libra sign, you'd be seeing the planet Ketu, the shadowy planet Ketu, the south lunar node. Well, in the fifth house, in the Scorpio sign, there wouldn't be any planets. In the sixth house, in the Sagittarius sign, you'd be seeing the planets Sun and Mercury. And in the 7th house, in the Capricorn sign, you'd be seeing the planets Saturn and Venus. But the significant thing to note here is that on the 17th of January 2023, the planet Saturn will move into the Aquarius sign. That means it will be 8th from your moon sign. And hence you will be experiencing Ashtam Shani. Well, in the 9th house, in the Pisces sign, you'd be seeing the planet Jupiter. In the 10th house, in the Aries sign, you'd be seeing the planets Rahu and Moon. Rahu being the North Lunar Node. And in the 11th house, in the Taurus sign, you'd be seeing the planet Mars. And in the 12th house, you'd be seeing no planets. So this will be the planetary position for y'all on the 1st of January 2023. Well, seeing the planetary positions on the 1st of January 2023, and the planetary positions during the year 2023. I want to tell y'all something today. Cancer Moon Sun people, I want to tell y'all that during the year, you are gonna be in a fight. You are gonna be in a fight at this juncture. You know, everybody in this world, consciously or subconsciously, is fighting in his or her life. And at this point in time, you will be in a serious fight. The reason for your fight would be that you will be experiencing some problems, some difficulties, some ordeals, some predicaments, some worries, some barriers, hurdles and obstacles in your life. Well, there is nothing to fear about these things because everyone in this world experiences problems, difficulties, worries, sorrows, predicaments, ordeals, hurdles, barriers and obstacles. So if you face the fiery furnaces of this world during this time, there is nothing new in it. Millions and billions of people have faced the fiery furnaces of this world in the past and many are facing right now and many are gonna face in the future. You know, this is how the world goes on. So don't find it strange for you to face the fiery furnaces of this world. I mean the problems and difficulties during the year 2023. You know, life is a fight for territory. And once you stop fighting for what you want, the things which you don't want will automatically take over. My point is that you need to fight at this point in time. I'm not telling you all to fight with weapons and ammunition. I'm telling you to face your challenges in your life in the year 2023. And you have to face your challenges in your life in the year 2023 with all your might, with all your power, with all your strength, with all your determination. You know, you need to show some extreme willpower at this point in time. So at this point in time, you need to show your guts to the life you are facing in the year 2023. Well, when a human being is going through struggles, problems, difficulties, it is then when they become stronger. And remember one thing, that the things which don't kill you makes you stronger. So at this point in time, when you will face the struggles, the challenges of your life, you are going to become a stronger person when you come out of that situation.
you have to fight for everything at this point in time you need to fight for your business you need to fight for your job you need to fight for your career you need to fight for your profession you need to fight for your education you need to fight for your relationships love relationships children property money health etc 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 well you need to tell yourself that you ain't gonna go down without a fight and if you continue fighting in the year 2023 with all your might, with all your power, with all your strength, then life is going to get defeated by you and you are going to become victorious in your life. You are going to see a win in your life like never before. You know, the harder the battle, the sweeter the victory. So this battle which you will be fighting at this point in time will make you emerge stronger in life. And that is exactly what we want. Well, I just told you all that life is a fight for territory. And once you stop fighting for what you want, the things which you don't want will automatically take over. So if you fight for your health, then no sickness, no illness will come into your life. And to keep good health, you need to focus on your eating habits. You need to exercise. You need to do all the things which will make you healthy in your life. In other words, you have to follow a regimen strictly. But that fight should continue. So my point is that you have to face your challenges in your life with all your might, with all your power, with all your strength, with all your determination, with all your willpower. The things which have been given to you, if you do them properly, then I'd say that you will excel in your spiritual field as well. In other words, wherever God has placed you in your life, face your own challenges. That very field is your spiritual field. By facing your own challenges with the right and correct mental attitude, you are gonna improve spiritually. Your mind is gonna get purified when you face your challenges with the right mental attitude. You are gonna purify your mind. You can improve and reach the highest. So don't shrug off your responsibilities. Face them diligently and tenaciously. Don't be a wimp at this point in time. Well, this is all I wanted to tell Cancer Moon Sign people about the year 2023. Well, now let me cover all the areas of the life for Cancer Moon Sign people. Well, for people who are doing a job, let me tell you that this year is gonna be a tough year for y'all. You are gonna see some ups and downs at your workplace where you are doing a job. You might have to work harder than before during the year 2023. You might get an increment in your salary after May 2023. But you wouldn't be satisfied with that increment in your salary package. You could face some enmity and opposition from your peers and colleagues at this point in time. They can give you a rough time in the year 2023. They might try to tarnish your image in front of your bosses and superiors. And this will make things worse for you in the year 2023. Well, you need to be discreet with your colleagues and peers in the year 2023. Well, for those people who are trying to find a job for themselves, they are most likely to get that job after May 2023. And whenever you get that job, whenever you get that job opportunity after May 2023, just grab it. Don't delay Dali about that decision of you joining that company. Whatever salary you get, join that company immediately. Because working at this point in time is more important than the salary package. It could be that you join that company right now and you get a better offer I mean a better job for yourself later on in the year. You need to keep yourself mentally occupied at this point in time. You need to keep yourself physically occupied at this point in time. You need to get out of the house at this point in time and start working. All I am telling y'all is to say yes to any job opportunity y'all get in the year 2023. 
Well, for business people, this year is gonna be a better year for y'all. I mean much better than the year 2022. You are gonna see some increase in your business in the year 2023. Things are gonna get better for you as the year goes by gradually. Though you could face some staff problems, employee problems in the year 2023. You could also face some money problems after June 2023. I mean you may not be able to execute orders because of the lack of money. Well, for people who are wanting to do a new business, they should wait before they start a new business. I mean, they should start a new business only after July 2023. Well, on the health front, this year is gonna be a very good year for y'all. You are gonna see good health for yourself in the year 2023. You are gonna make a conscious, deliberate and a determined effort to stay healthy in the year 2023. All your past illnesses, all your past diseases, all your past sickness are gonna end in the year 2023. If you are suffering from a chronic disease, then during the year 2023, you are gonna recover from that chronic illness very easily. I mean, you are gonna find a medicine or a doctor who will cure you in the year 2023. It could also be that you find a very easy solution to your chronic illness in the year 2023. By an easy solution, I mean you could find a home remedy for yourself. However, the parts of the body which you need to take care of during the year are your sexual organs, your digestive system, your eyes and your bones. So if you face any problems regarding these parts, these organs of the body, then you should give special attention to it. Drinking lots of water and exercising in the year 2023 should be a part of your daily life. Well, for people who are in a love relationship, let me tell you all that this year is gonna be a fantastic year for y'all. You or your love partner may propose to the other in the year 2023. But I'd suggest you all not to marry during the year 2023. I'd suggest you all to wait for a year or two before you get married. Well, your love partner is gonna support you mentally, emotionally, spiritually and financially in the year 2023. They are gonna show a lot of love for you in the year 2023. And things could get better for you as the year progresses. There would be complete harmony between you and your love partner in the year 2023. However, you need to be careful from your friends who might try to create a misunderstanding between you and your love partner. Well, for people who are wanting a love partner for themselves, I'm telling you all that you are gonna find that love partner after May 2023. And this particular love partner can become your life partner as well. So people who are wanting a love or are in a love relationship, they are gonna see good times in the year 2023. Well, for students, this year is gonna be an awesome year for y'all. You are gonna excel in your studies in the year 2023. You are gonna get that focus, that attention on your studies which had been lost in the previous years. You are gonna pass all your exams with flying colors in the year 2023. And you could also be awarded or recognized for your efforts in your academics in the year 2023. The only source of mass destruction for y'all would be your electronic gadgets. I mean your computer, your laptop, your notebook, your mobile phones. So use these electronic gadgets only for your studies and not for anything else. I mean, apart from your studies, you shouldn't use these gadgets in the year 2023. Well, for married people, this year is gonna be a very tough year for y'all. You and your spouse are gonna remain at loggerheads in the year 2023. You and your spouse are gonna have some differences in the year 2023. I'm not saying you will have a divorce in the year 2023. But there would be some misunderstanding between you and your spouse in the year 2023. And that would be because of your relatives, your friends, your loved ones, your near and dear ones. 
either your spouse's family or your family might try to create misunderstanding between y'all maybe your family or your spouse's family might bad mouth you or your spouse so if you face any people who are trying to bad mouth your spouse in front of you you should ignore them you should avoid them well for people who are wanting to get married let me tell you all that this year is not an auspicious year for you to get married you might find a life partner for yourself but i'd suggest you all not to marry in the year 2023 once you meet your life partner you need to know your life partner well before you enter into a wedlock don't take any sort of hasty decisions any sort of impulsive decisions in regard to your marriage in the year 2023 well for people who are in the stock market they should refrain themselves from investing in the stock markets this year they should hold on to their investments which they had made in the earlier years they shouldn't be bold and aggressive in investing their money in the stock market well if you see that you are making a loss on your investments in the year 2023 then i'd suggest you all to be patient at this point in time continue staying invested in those stocks which you had purchased earlier don't panic at this point in time because sooner rather than later maybe not in this year but later on you will see that your investments are giving you handsome returns well for people who are gambling in the stock market or anywhere else they need to be very careful at this point in time they need to avoid gambling totally in the year 2023 because there is a strong chance of you losing money in the year 2023 so refrain from stock market gambling or any sort of gambling activity in the year 2023 well for people who are in debt let me tell you that this year is not going to be a good year for you you are going to see that your creditors will put pressure on you to get money from you you could also be served a legal notice at this point in time you could also face some problems from the government in regard to that debt you have taken during the year 2023 you might lose something very precious during the year 2023 just because you might have to repay that loan that debt you have taken in the previous years well if you get some money from somewhere i'd suggest you all to pay that loan that emi that installment of that loan which you have taken and then use the rest of the money for discretionary or essential needs try to avoid try to ignore any sort of legal situation if you face one in the year 2023 well cancer moon sign people here is something else for you all i want to tell you all that you must do this remedy which i'm going to speak right now in this video if you want to protect yourself from all the dangers of this world if you want your strength and power to increase in the year 2023 then you must do this remedy which i'm going to speak about right now in this video you can do this remedy at any time of the year i mean in the year 2023 all you have to do is do a simple donation and that donation is you have to give 17 rupees each to eight different poor people the second step of the remedy is that you have to give 17 pet bottles of a black cola beverage to 17 different poor people one each to those 17 different poor people buy a black cola beverage i mean you can give a thumbs up a coca cola or a pepsi to those 17 different poor people you can buy 17 pet bottles and distribute one each to those 17 different poor people and the third step of this remedy is that you have to distribute three black blankets or three black umbrellas to three different poor people well this is a very powerful remedy you can do during the year 2023 Well this pretty much completes my analysis about cancer moon sign people for the year 2023 if you want some specific predictions about yourself then you may contact me directly well like i always say that if you wish to know your future through astrology and you are determined to live the best possible version of yourself 
Well, one must always try to live his or her best version of themselves because there is only one life to live. There are no duplicates of a life. You will not get a chance to live this beautiful life once again. And if you want to enhance your luck in your life, if you want to boost your luck in your life, if you want to increase and improve your luck in your life, then I want to tell you all, I have several remedies for you. You know, these remedies which I'm talking about are a fusion of astrological remedies, Vastu remedies and religious remedies which can be utilized by any person of any religion because I believe that there is only one God in this universe. I'm talking about that God who has created this universe and all the things in it including us. Well, if there were different gods in this universe, then the color of the human blood would be different in different human beings. But that is not the case. The color of the human blood is red in all the human beings of this planet Earth. Hence, you will understand that there is only one God in this universe. Well, you can also contact me if you want me to pray for you. Because prayer can move mountains. So if you want me to pray for your health, wealth, success, prosperity, money, relationships, love relationships, career, job, business, marriage, married life, children, property, etc, 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 then also you may contact me. And if you want a Vastu visit of your flat, office, residence, factory, etc, 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 then also you may contact me. And if you are hell-bent on taking your life from the ridiculous to the sublime, from the low point to the high point, from nothing to something, then you may contact me over WhatsApp. My WhatsApp number has been given on this video. Have a great day and a great life ahead. God bless you all. Jai Matadi. Jai Ma Kali.